It all happened so fast. After two years as head coach, Freddie Juarez decided to move on in the middle of the season. You know, it happened really quickly. It was in the last 48 hours that we all sat down and, and, and realized this is where things were headed. And Freddie expressed the desire to, you know, to take an opportunity and, and to move on. Now, the team had an option on Juarez's contract at the end of the season, and perhaps Juarez sensed he wasn't going to be re-signed. But general manager Elliot Fall said those talks never took place. There was no conversation uh, throughout the year about, you know, Freddie's future with the club beyond Beyond this year, we had an option in the contract and, and the ability to, to keep him moving forward. Um, but, you know, that was, we had all discussed that that was a, you know, an end of season conversation. Juarez guided RSL through some tough times. He took over after Mike Pecky was fired and he led him through all the turmoil of the pandemic. This season, RSL is above the playoff line, but has a mediocre record of 7-7-6. Seven, seven, and six. The team is preparing to play Vancouver Sunday, and they were taken aback by the news. Oh, I think they were certainly surprised a bit, but, but they're professionals, and, and for better and worse, this is a group that that has seen a lot of change and a lot of upheaval. So while a search has begun, assistant Pablo Mastroeni takes over. Mastroeni has plenty of head coaching experience, having led the Colorado Rapids for four seasons. Pablo's been an integral part of putting this group together and an integral part of uh, you know, creating the culture and the foundation of what we've you know, built so far this year. So. I don't think we're going to see significant changes. Despite the ownership of the team being in flux, Fall says the leadership of the club is not. We're looking for somebody who's going to come in and, and continue to, to, to maximize uh, you know, the talent on this roster. We all believe that this is a club that has seen great heights in the past and, and, and should be there again soon. Dana Green, ABC4 Sports.